I'm no unboxy person, but we'll keep doing this. Welcome back to the Leading Act channel, guys. The show that teaches you to eliminate the struggle from your life. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm super excited today because today is the beginning of a vacation week. And here I am on a Friday night talking to internet strangers. I'm definitely not a tool. What we're doing today, it's not gonna be an improvement of any kind, but as you've checked in the descriptions, we are going to be opening a box for the Omega Speedmaster Moonwatch. It's very rare, it's about a $5,000 watch, and um, I'm really excited, so let's get to it. I'm not really a watch opening person or an unboxing person, but we'll get to it right now. First off, I opened the box. When I opened the box, it was in another box. And then inside of that box was this box. It is quite heavy and it is inside of one of these sleeve things. So we're gonna take that off. So you can see that there, all right? Talk about the lighting. Oh, shit. it wants to open. All right, here it is. It's just inside of one of these sleeves. Pretty cool stuff. So you can get in there, see that? It looks just super duper cool. There's like a little crown here. Let me show you how that opens up. So this opens up, there's a little seal, and inside of this box is another box. Looks like on the back here, we've got a warranty card and a serial number, and we have this really cool box inside. So I'm gonna set this down and take that out and show you. Carefully. Oh, and a blonde woman's hair is in here, so thank you for leaving that. Close. All right. Could be a long-haired man. I don't discriminate. It's 2020. Uh, two more books. We have the Le Legendary Moonwatch and the Speedmaster. I am not sure what date this is. And here's that. Here's some nice literature. Some of you watch fans. I'm no urban gentry. But some of you watch fans out there can tell me what the hell this is. All right, so in 57, blah, 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 blah. Nice watch, look at that guy. I don't know who that guy is. Internet people, tell me who that guy is. Good job, okay. To the opening. All right, once that is out, you have this box here. It's like a cardboard material. Very sturdy. There's that really nice crest with the seahorse in there. Look at that, just purdy. He's purdier than a three ball Tomcat. All right, and there's a really cool latch mechanism here. And you pull this up and it undoes it. Which I think that's really cool. Nice and stretchy, really, really high quality. And then on the front, it also says Omega Speedmaster Legendary Moon Watch really cool. All right, now when you open it up, you've also got a really nice section here. Looks like one of these. I have no idea, just a piece of foam there. Probably to protect this medallion. And some of you might be asking, where is the watch? And if you read the description, I said we're opening the box because I can't afford a $5,000 watch. What am I made of money? However, I have a watch box, so I'm showing it to you because I think it's interesting. Before you guys bust out all the pitchforks, actually my buddy is currently in Syria. He's able to secure this watch. He's got the watch. The box was sent to me for safekeeping and I'm going to be getting it to him after he comes back from deployment. So back to the video. Maybe we can get Urban Gentry over here and he can help out. All right, there's some little holes here. Ooh. There's a loop. Look at that loop. Let's see, let's see if you magnify stuff. Oh. Can it magnify stuff? Ooh, it magnifies stuff. I'm not sure what that's for, but they include it, so good job. And what's in here? Looks like, uh, ooh, a Omega watch strap. Part number, Sierra Echo Bravo 121-000-30-200. That's cool. Um, looks like a watch tool and a little tube of poly watch. That's pretty cool stuff. 
All right. Well, with that, guys, I hope you really enjoyed this unboxing of the Speedmaster box. I really do enjoy this box. Maybe one day, with your help, I could actually afford one of these watches. And with that, if you liked any of this, if you thought it was funny, if you thought it was entertaining, to like and subscribe. I'll continue bringing you some content. I don't really care. It's Friday night on vacation week. Let me know down in the description what which watch box I should review next. All right, guys. We'll see you next time.